Hi, in this video, we'll have a look at one of the interview questions asked in Java. So you are given a map and you have to sort the map by value. Let's see how we can do this. Here we have a map and map has country and capitals. So India, Delhi, England, London and so on. So one of the ways you can do this is we have a method here called sort and it takes a map. Inside a method, we have a list, a simple array list. Array list, as you know, maintains the insertion order. And then we have a linked hash map. So linked hash map constructs an empty insertion order. Linked hash map instance with default capacity of 16 and load factor 75. So an uh, important thing here is insertion ordered linked hash map. So both of them maintain the insertion order. Here inside the list we add all the values of the map and then we sort it. So we have a list containing the values of the map sorted in a natural order. Next we iterate on the list. We take the cities and inside we have another loop which loops on the entry set checks if the value equals to city that is the item in the list and if yes it puts it in the linked hash map so it is an end to end n square complexity and we get a sorted map so that's one of the ways the old way of doing it next we write two comparators so this is our lambdas for this one is by key so we have our map dot entry so here we compare two items by key so we get the key from the entry and we compare it by the next element. Similarly, for by value, we compare the values of both the element. Then we pass it to our stream. We do a map dot entry set dot stream. We sort the stream by key. So we pass our comparator here and then we collect it inside a new hash map and hence we get a sorted by key map. Similarly, we pass our by value to the streams sorted method and then we collect it in a new linked hash map and we get a sorted by value hash map. There is one more easy way of doing it without writing the comparator as we already have a comparator inside our entry class. So you can do a compare by key and compare by value. So you don't have to pass the comparators here. You can simply pass compare by key and compare by value. Next, I'm just printing everything here. So you will get the result of sort, which is printed here. And then our custom comparators, which are passed to this result sets. And also compare by key and compare by value. Let's run this and see how it looks. So this is the result of our sort method. So we sort by value. So we have Beijing, Canberra, that is B, C, L, N, R, and T. Next, we have our custom comparator. So this is the result. So by value matches the sort method result set and by key we get A, C, E, I, I and Japan. Similarly by key by value if you are using the entry dot compare by key and entry dot compare by value the result matches our custom compare. So get A, C, E, I and then it comes as B, C, L, N, R and Tokyo. So that's how you can solve this question. Thanks for watching.